yeah just that I feel like girls usually have like a really negative assessment of like are, are always like oh where are all the good guys or whatever like all men cheat or whatever but I don't feel that way I don't know even even though I've like been cheated on I like still don't feel that way I feel like I know like lots of very high value guys and girls telling themselves like there's only terrible guys out there I don't know like who who that serves and also I just think they're wrong like they from are. my experience I've met like quite a few um I have like no like I don't know like upwards of 10 like high value guys that have a problem finding like girls and they are like um you know, how, how do they have a problem thing. well just or just not even that but that even like high value guys get cheated on and I think girls underestimate like even if they see a high value guy they're like oh I can never be with that person I don't know but like um I think girls think that there's a very small amount and that they're super unattainable and I super don't think that's true I mean on the one hand you have to be like a high value like woman but if you're that I mean you, I don't think you have anything to be worried about there's nothing I, to stress about I, you'll meet them I'd like to know when you say high value woman what what exactly does that mean to you that's a great question yeah someone who knows what they want um is very takes good care of herself herself is has like good sense of humor we don't care about that <laughs> You don't, or not, okay, not yeah, all. someone not who has all. high standards for guys who like um, has her priorities in line, has a good social life, knows how to have fun, balances things. Here's a question: What do you think makes a good wife? I feel like I really don't know what to say about this, but I'm guessing it's not that much different than what you would want and a good husband considering it's like a partnership very different very different okay yep. well then i'm guessing it's someone who's more of like the okay, i guess that is true but i guess so someone maybe more of like a caretaker nurturer um has like i mean i know for me as a wife like my number one priority will be my kids making sure they have everything they need raising them properly yeah that's a good correctly mother. that's being um, that's being a good mother but let's let me reframe the question yeah i want you to picture like the perfect guy in your mind for you to marry okay High value, yeah. handsome, probably funny, makes a decent amount of money, okay? A guy like that is going to have a lot of options that he can pick from. Yeah. He's going to be, if he's looking for marriage, he's going to be looking for a woman who's going to make a good wife. Yeah. Because there's women that make terrible wives and there's women that make great wives. What do you think you would need to embody as a woman to be that great wife for a guy like that? Someone he would want to wake up to and go to sleep to every morning. So, someone who will make his life positive, happy, fun, be the peace, not the pain kind of deal. So, yeah, just fun, positive, loving, hot. It's fun to be hot. So, healthy, like has their priorities in line. Yeah, and enjoys them and appreciates them. I Things like how you amazing. started that answer. Have you guys ever heard the saying, it's a woman's job to make her man's dick hard, not his life hard? Mm -hmm. disgusting <laughs> but it's it's, it's true. true it's true i i actually just saw something pop up just now that said high value men don't cheat on high value women well he wasn't a high value guy so i'm not worried okay. about that in my case but yes, right, that's right. a great but, point but, I, I but totally the points the true. points that it's really rare to find a woman who's truly high value meaning that she i think that's true as well that yeah. she she yeah. understands she understands how important it is yeah. to that she respects the man that, that, that she's with. One thing that I don't think girls know enough about, and correct me if I'm wrong, but it's that guys care way more about respect than I think girls think they do. Yeah, that's everything. Yeah, that's I think huge. I think girls don't know that. And and so that is the number one thing that like one of the main things that I look for, like in a person. Well that's how that's how someone we, I would respect that, am I showing him. That's respect? how we operate. I mean Does that's he how respect me. That's, that's how men right operate. We yeah. we operate girls off don't of respect. Think about that. Girls we say like, oh we want respect. If girls want to respect, they wouldn't choose guys that disrespect them every day of their lives. I'm telling you, girls don't care about respect in the way that guys do, even if they think that's they why this they e that's don't. why this equal thing is this, that's why this equal list. thing isn't isn't right because you know you'll say a guy will say we need a woman to respect us, but we don't respect women in the same exact way, and girls will get upset by that. But it's not the same thing. We love women. We we have to be respected in order to love them. So a second ago, did you say that you want a man who you respect? Um, Something yeah, along those I mean, lines. if you don't respect, I mean, I feel that way with friendships as well. I mean, anyone in your life, if you don't respect them, they shouldn't be in your life. You're wasting both your time. So I love that you said that because this is, I think, one of the biggest problems in the dating world. A lot of guys, 
are not worthy of respect. They don't command respect from their women. And it's not, it's not the kind of thing that you have to command, like, you have to respect me. It's not that kind of thing. I think dudes earn respect from their women. Yeah, and it's an earning thing. It's, you wanna, it, it's, it's, a, it's a fun, like, positive thing to seek out guys who are worth appreciating and appreciating them. Like, that's, that's so, like a win-win scenario. Yeah, so I, I was going somewhere with that. My question to you is what, what makes a man worthy of respect in your eyes as a woman? That's, that's a great one. It's, okay, so worthy of respect. He has to have respect for himself, for his body, for his family for his friends, know the worth of um, his social relationships, know the worth of his work, be um, ambitious, have like a genuine desire to contribute to his community, understand boundaries, be polite. It's kind of like a, a long way. Do, like, do, you, do you think it's a good thing when there's boundaries in a relationship? Like Absolutely. It, is, it, is it a red flag for you if a guy doesn't have boundaries? Yeah. What, what, what does that mean? What do you mean? Like when I say boundaries, I'm saying like if a guy, if a guy just doesn't, just lets his girl do anything and she can really control him, because a lot of girls will push that. They'll, they'll, they'll push for a guy that lets them do whatever they want to do, but then they'll leave him. So what, what I'm saying is... That comes down to respect. That comes down to respect. 